getting cards out of my hand because I'm going to be needing a lot of... Ooh. Wow. Wait. How is this going to work? Promising future with this. So we double promising future. I don't know. This is probably going to be great. I don't know what's going to happen here, but it's probably going to be great. And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some action karma. Going to be our next meme tier Monday deck. This one is going to be about Vicarin Bruiser being able to strike and create lucky finds. We're going to be trying to have this Bruiser strike a bunch of different ways, making some lucky finds. We're going to have Boomerang Blade, be able to strike with the Bruiser, tw strike twice, Siphoning Strike, and we got a Grappling Hook, and then of course just attacking as well. Um, so that's that's kind of what we're doing here. We're making like a, a Bruiser deck where the Bruiser can make all these lucky finds. The lucky finds can go on the action to uh, help level up the action. Um, or really just any any of your units really, you know, to uh, to do that. So we'll also have Karma as our other thing because, you know, once we have, once we're enlightened, A, Karma will just create random spells. That's cool. But then once we're enlightened, all of our spells get cast twice. So imagine casting a boomerang blade twice, like where, where you strike the strongest and the weakest enemy twice. That could be really cool. That could be four strikes for the bruiser. That's kind of awesome. That's kind of what we're going to try to do. Uh, but besides that, then we'll have like the flurry of fists that can be cast twice. So like the first one's quick attack, and then the second one will give the double attack. Um, we could you can double up the absolver, so it's like plus four, plus two, and then another plus four, plus two, and overwhelm. So like plus eight, plus four for four mana. That sounds crazy. So yeah, that's what we're going to kind of have. We'll have a couple of Green Glade Lookouts in here, reducing the cost of Karma and Bruiser, let it, letting us get those in a little earlier, and just, you know, a whole lot of spells uh, to go along with our unit. So it's action, it's Karma, it's Meme Tier Monday. Let's go play five games and have some fun. Playing against Aurelia Azir first. We got one Sentinel, one Ruined. All right, I'm gonna keep all this. The Tasty Fate Folk seems like a good blocker to keep us alive, and we can use the bru you know, like the Bruiser strikes. It makes the lucky find. Then we can lucky find it, and then grappling hook and try to take down a champion that way. Okay, all right, Rad. Have a good rest of your day, and I will see you later. Oh, really? Action? Could have had you last round. So if I play action right now... Alright, cool. So the champion spell is another grappling hook. We'll see which one of us is stronger, Akshan. Have we met? Villains beware. I will have double attack action. Wait, that doesn't, yeah, that doesn't work. What am I doing? I was thinking, you know, like, get that going so we have the two targets for the palace. That, that was just worthless. Okay, that was worthless. Okay, I don't know what I'm... I don't know why I did that. <laughs> that was pretty bad. That was pretty bad. Alright, let's 
predict draw card. Have a twin disciplines just in case. Yep, no surprise there. The cliffs themselves are my barracks. Can we take down his ear? With the grappling hook? Oh, no, they had a shape stone. Overwhelm, Fearsome, plus one, plus one. I'm gonna go with the plus one, plus one. That's gonna... That's just gonna let it block a lot better. Or just a little bit more, but the... The Overwhelm's awesome against, like, their their recall and stuff, but... I wanna just keep increasing the health... ...of these things. Okay, so next round I probably wanna play Leveled Up Action, probably wanna play Tasty Faith Folk. Or... we could just Siphoning Strike to try to kill Azir. Azir's about to level up. Mm, that's easy to stop. That's a lot of mana. Okay. Starting with action. Fixing the world, one scoundrel at a time. Don't want to die? Don't do terrible things. Cool. Cycle Cap agreed with the plus one, plus one. Alright, so the thing... Okay, cool. I guess that'll do. I was gonna say the thing is that we don't get both Syncopation and Twin Disciplines, but... Doesn't matter. That Brutes was really nice in that matchup. Like, how I can just sit back and, like, block those little 1-1 Sand Soldiers and make Lucky Finds each time. Like, that Bruiser is nice. That's kind of what our deck's about. All right, am I mulliganing Preservarium? Obviously, we're going to keep the one, two, three. Um, I th think I may mulligan the Preservarium and look for look for spells. Bye, Nasher. Have a wonderful day at work. Worry about their merciless hunter getting rid of my action. I do not break rules, I bend them slightly. Slightly. Don't want to die? Don't do terrible things. Villains beware. This probably isn't worth it. I'm actually here. Good. 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 Finally got a, a good spell for this matchup. That. We love it when they run. In and out. Won't let me grappling hook that thing also, unfortunately. Well, let's see if they have Shapestone. Hopefully not. I still am representing two mana over here, so they could still be scared of something else. Okay, that's good. And that's even better. Villains 
beware. Yeah, let's make that trade. This one's a fighter. Is worthless. We are what we do. You can thank me later. The Absolver. Can we get there? Yeah. You cannot run from absolution. Okay. So don't get to grappling hook anything. A siphoning strike. I think it's just going to be a, a 4 3 double attack. Siphoning strike's not great if they have Sivir. If, like that's their card. You know, no, let's, let's grab this Preservarium. That's the best card to grab. I was really looking at the other two and I was ignoring the Preservarium, but no, the, the Preservarium is the best thing to get. Alright, good. Yeah, that was, that was the best card to get, that Preservarium. Look at that, and then we still got the Siphoning Strike anyway. So no Sivir, please. Something that I can strike. Arda's gonna make a meal of them. Okay, I can strike that. Ooh. This thing double attack? And I got deny. Oh boy. Oh no, we don't get to <laughs> we don't get to do it. Alright. We'll take it. That's a win. GG's. One step closer to a our things had the plus three and sharp sights had the plus two, and that was the difference with our actions beating their actions. Viego Shivana. Spooky dragons. I like it. They got the ruined Shivana. I like it. Could keep backup action for if this action dies. But I'll just send him back. Look for some protection. Like Shapestone, Twin Disciplines, all that kind of stuff. Take the high ground. We will be leading with action to get the countdown started. Sorry, look out. No blocks. Interesting. I became a Cameron Boren soldier. Yeah, they get the 4-2. I'll probably be able to get that 4-2 with something anyway. But now we can have 4 mana karma. Which I think that's my plan, 4 mana karma. I could also just Merciless Hunter the Escaped Abomination and challenge it. Maybe that's the play, but I really like playing karma. Alright, we'll go with that play. Gonna find a gift for an acting. Right, Arda? Taste faith, folk. That looks like a Shivana to me. 
It's going to be a 5 power Shivana. Okay, not Shivana. Still a 6 5. We'll bring peace to Ionia, whatever the cost. Quit struggling. Down to ten. What we got? Scrying sands. That could be useful. Gently, gently. <laughs> Looks like I'm ready. Bye bye. Cool. That ghost could also be useful. Man, I'm not gonna get this other plus two plus one. Unless okay, so I could use I could just throw away the ghost to level up action, so then I get the other plus two plus one. But I guess I don't probably Will I need that other plus two plus one? I mean I will if they have sharp sight. Probably better safe than sorry. Is what I mean. You cannot run from absolution. Oh, I don't even make it anyway. Well, that was just a waste. I wanted something so like if they have sharp sight right here, I wanted something to like that's that was like the whole reason why I did that, because I wanted that additional two mana plus two plus one to protect against sharp sight. Oh, they just have single combat. Well, I guess I can't really stomp that. No, because this this goes to four health and then four power. Okay. Yup, yup. There is nothing like that pain. How you said karma would be able to stop it? How? Grappling hooks. Arna's gonna make a meal of them. Karma, one more health. Oh, if I would have targeted Karma in the beginning. Who brings a dragon to a gunfight? Okay, I do have another action. If something happens to this action. I should maybe be attacking with the lookout just to clear up a space. Yeah, I, I did. I did the other card for the yeah for the health gain. That's what I tried to do. You're you're still at six. That's so far away. Don't want to die. Don't do terrible things. Okay. This karma creating random cards for us has been pretty good. But then again, so is Hydravine. I see you there. <laughs> yeah, who knew? Random cards are good, especially from Shurima and Ionia. 
has to be an enemy. Well, it's been fun. Yeah, I guess so. Double Hydrovine. Getting cards out of my hand because I'm going to be needing a lot of... Ooh. Wow. Wait. How is this going to work? Promising future with this. That we double promising future. I don't know. This is probably going to be great. I don't know what's going to happen here, but it's probably going to be great. All right, now we got room for all these cards. Uh, not so good, not so good, not gonna lie. So this first card doesn't matter because then we're just going to predict again and it's just going to shuffle it up. So that part, it just doesn't matter choosing any of these cards. So now we actually choose a card. All right, Boomerang. Which we can double Boomerang, but if they have removal, like they've been having all these fight spells. But we might as well try. Or I just skip. And look for like Deny or something or... I don't know what. I Maybe we just skip. Maybe I should take that other action... I just I can't even cast grappling hook. Good, I like that tonight. So what am I doing with these Warlord's Hordes? No, that's... No, sounds like I'm supposed to deny that. Maybe I'm not. Reconsider. We're gonna get drained by this thing. Bruiser doesn't exactly get the Horde online. What am I going to be doing with this, anyway? Grant all enemies vulnerable, create a zero-cost copy of the strongest ally that died this game. Is that Merciless Hunter? I'm just going to do this three times. I need to get cards out of my hand. I just don't want... I don't want any of my allies to attack. That's seven... See, Shapestone and Twin Disciplines, these are the cards I want. Of course, it's going to get shuffled again. Alright, we'll take the Twin Disciplines. Rex goes bag loot. Blah, blah. She gets it. No place for the card. And these all get doubled? So if we go... Alright. Champions plus two plus two spell shield. We just keep doing that a bunch? Should probably draw four cards. I don't know. Try to get a grappling hook out of here. I want to get cards out of my hand so I have enough room to draw stuff. Yeah. Atrocity's fun! We have learned as much as we have 
suffered. We are going to be, you know, clearing up, up our hand a little bit. Then we're going to draw forward, make everything cost two less, look for the Absolver. Hopefully hit that. Tom Kench, Fiora. I can see these all being pretty good against Fiora. Like, these are not easy things to kill. We're going to have the card draw, you know, extra card draw. The swamp is good. Yeah, that was, that was going to... That was, um, that did have, like, some real potential for how that was going to finish up. Spell mana. Steal from the rich and give to the us. Wow. Table for one, if you oblige. You would test my steel. This is worth. Maybe spell shield? Kench is down to being one health. Fully heal an ally, then double its power and health. It's going to be a 412 now. I'm not playing any kind of Will of Ionia type card, as far as I know. So I want this countdown to finish up before I play the Vagabond to be able to get a new countdown going. Oh, I don't require a menu. Magic has no place. That is good. Okay, I guess they don't have the mana for that. Alright, let's predict draw. Spirit's Refuge? That doesn't help against captures. that thing to eight. Come on in. I think sharp sight's like the best they can have. Oh. Mind. One mana short from, you know, swap them and then siphoning strike fight. This is going to be difficult to pull off. Must be nice living off stolen coin. Whip 
them holding that fast speed capture if they just chill with that. Man, I need a I need a will of Ionia in the worst way. So if they only have one unit in play, would it strike the same one twice? Because then it'd be the strongest and the weakest. Good news we won't draw any more of these treasure seekers. You don't think it does? Excuse my impertinence. All shall drown in my magnificence! Here the guards, boss. Good. Now let me do my thing. Let us reconnoitre. Your funeral. So I'll put this to four health. Do it. Six. Are you living? So basically, I'm thinking, like, if I could do this, and then maybe that lucky find gets plus one, plus one on, like, the Vagabond, and then Siphoning Strike. They, they gotta have more protection with that mana. Not a chance. We gotta have more protection with that mana. Gently, gently. <laughs> with the capture. Yeah, okay, so that, that's what I thought. Okay, so it, it does work. It will strike the, the unit twice. Always two steps ahead. That's what I thought. I thought it would. So close to killing the Tom Kench yet, still so far. Four cards in hand. Bayou Brunch. So they're having the Fiora capture the Tom Kench. Fiora, Fiora only has three health now. That's got to be difficult to have that Fiora survive this. Why didn't I just do the Lucky Find first and maybe get plus one, plus one, or a Spell Shield or something? But yeah, okay. Alright, they do get the Tom Kench back, but that's fine. Okay, so now my Karma's a 6-5. We'll bring peace to Ionia, whatever the cost. Oh, that... does that still work? You had your chance to walk away. Oh, I didn't think that still worked. I was going to use these lucky finds on the karma. Well, that was dumb. Where's spell shield at? I was thinking that was a new Tom Kench and I wouldn't use that old acquire taste. But I guess it's the same Tom Kench, so it did. Yep, now that karma goes away. Well, that wasn't so good. Your funeral. Took it fair and square. Most likely using the detain. Mm. 
wonder how much this is worth. There's the spell shield. I like all these, but I, I think I really want to find my champions right now, so I'm going to skip because I really want to draw karma or action. And in particular, karma or action with. Today we turn the tide of war. Um, like a Preservarium, also, like that, that could also work. Okay, that was cool. I don't change faith. Yeah, Bruiser doing its thing. Exactly what we, what we want it to. Let's get some 5 twos. Some extra 5 twos attacking in here. They're at 11. I've got your back. So we got 7 mana. Enough for all three of these spells in hand. My shield is yours. You pay first. Number five. I'll put him to uh, zero. And there we go. GG's. All right, got there. Good job, Bruiser. Yeah, had that lethal with the overwhelm. Ooh, we're playing against deep. Some deep sea monsters. I don't know. I could see syncopation being good because they have like the different challengers and stuff. But I also want um, want my champions. I should maybe be mulliganing the Bruiser, considering it's a five drop. But I mean, come on. Bruiser's been killing it for us. So gotta keep it. <laughs> I don't know why, I just, I really like that line. Got a lizard and a shovel. How do you know what, what it means, like, what it's in reference to or anything, but I like it. Yeah, we're a very good overwhelmed deck, but just Bruiser in general. Bruisers look good with action. Um, kind of want to just pass. Yeah, I'm just gonna pass and keep the shape stones available for another bile feast. Wow. Turbo deep. All right, well, no vile feast. They're not going to just be like a random go hard deck, right? Probably not. You like it? I mean, shut up and fight. Villains beware. Okay, sea scarabs. Sea Scarab is basically Maokai. I want to kill that thing. Fixing the world, one scoundrel at a time. All right, we'll get the Warlord's Horde going. And it's already down to seven. Twin disciplines or skip? I think we can skip. What was theirs is now ours. Ooh, the absolver. We already got one bruiser. I don't think they're really stopping this. I guess if they have jettison, it would stop it. Nice. 
Get that elusive out of here. That would draw them some cards. Um. Hmm. Don't have enough. That that takes seven mana for overwhelm double attack. Villains beware. Well, we can just attack. See how they block. Darn. All right. So if I go plus four overwhelm, that's nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. So we can just do those and try to kill them that way. You can thank me later. Which I guess I should have maybe just done this and then gotten the horde first. And then done the plus plus two plus two spell shield. I guess I could have just done that first. But that'll do. Alright. Action can be pretty silly. I like action and karma together. It's kind of similar to action and Lee Sin. So there we go. The Bruiser performed well. I liked Karma a lot. So both of our champions and Bruiser were awesome. And then, you know, you had your Hunter, your Faithful. They were doing their thing. That, that one of Vagabond did some good work. I liked having that. Um, grappling hooks were kind of hard to enable. I'm glad we only had one of those and not more of them. But, you know, the Syncopation was cool. Twin Disciplines, of course, is always broken. Um, yeah, I could see playing another Shape Stone. But the, the one of Flurry of Fist was okay, though, as well. Everything went pretty good, honestly. Everything did pretty good. I liked it. Fun little deck here. So fun little deck. Uh, I guess the probably the worst card in the deck was maybe the Green Glade Lookout. Um, yeah, that one was probably the worst, but it was it was still just fine. But I could see taking out Lookout and just playing like another Shape Stone and another, you know just maybe some more spells. Honestly, just you just play a third Shape Stone, third or second Secapation, something like that. Or you could play another Vagabond or Fey Folk. You could play another one of these. Or, you know, get another Spirit's Refuge. Spirit's Refuge is always good. Um, you know, something like that. I don't know if the... Like, Scattered Pod... Nah, you probably don't need Scattered Pod. Dawn and Dusk. Dawn and Dusk action. Whoa. Dawn and Dusk action. You get two summons and then two strikes. I don't know. That could be, that could be crazy. Especially if you use, like, some pump spells first. So I don't know. So maybe the Green Glade Lookout. Like that could be two. That that could probably be two slots. Like one Shape Stone plus one something else. You if you want to have more two drops, maybe you know you could have like the uh, Inspiring Chronomancer or Eye of the Dragon or uh, Rock Hopper. You could you could do some other stuff. Retreat Return maybe. There are a million cards that you can play. Saucy Mailman with the big time raid. Welcome Saucy and. Uh, all of the, uh, what we, <laughs> what's, what's the term? The, the Sauciites? I don't know. Welcome everybody from Saucy Stream. Let's, let's th throw some Saucy emotes in here. So we just finished up, um, yeah, some, let's get some Saucy T-mote, T-mote emotes. All the mailmen, the mail fans, okay. Uh, we just finished up an action karma deck that did really well, that we used a lot of bruiser lucky find stuff. That was really cool. So just finished that one up. All right, so uh, those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button, leave those comments, let me know what you think of this deck. And as always, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you for the next video.